number 23, Kim Dong-woo. Our Zetaha, Kim dong -woo. And number 14, Yi Dong-jun. Zetaha, Yi Dong-jun. And number 40, Yi Dong-jun. Okay,再次欢迎我们韩国三成篮球队。好，我们继续当中一个 Number 好,来,我们接下来我们本场比赛一个特殊的环节啊 So the game right now coming up between Qingdao of China The team in black and the team in white is the Korea 3x3 team from Seoul. Look at this, Vince. Entertainment <laughs> at its best. That is the new generation of basketball. Take a selfie before you go hammer and tongue. <laughs> when it comes to 3x3, it's all about community, man. When you can go on the court, you know, and just say, hey, we're brothers at this game that's newly bred. We're going to try our best, but still have that respect. I mean, I love seeing it, man. Well, let's just recap the players for the Qingdao team from China. Number zero, Geng Lin, who is, and let's have a look at that montage right there. The 2008 Sina Golden League, stop, the Qingdao stop champion, SGL finals runner-up in 2018. The team more famously known as NYW, Geng Lin, number 21, is number zero. Ji Yu Cheng, number 21, Liu To is number 30, and number 35 is... Pula, but Pula is not playing. Are they? No, is Pula playing? Number thirty-five. No, change the. This is the Korean team right there, Minsu Park, of course. But that's the Korean. Uh, that's the team lineup right there. Number twenty-one, Ji Yu Cheng. Number thirty-five is Pula. He is rostered to play. Geng Lin, number zero, and number. 30 is Liu Tong. So, yep, that is a f the team is in check. We've just had a number of changes today, everyone, because of injuries, certain players pulling out because of a personal situation. So, that happens in 3x3. I mean, in tournament basketball, it happens. You know, things happen in life. Oh, it's going to happen. But I want to shout out number 21, Ji Yu Chen. He actually came out the Three Ball USA Milpita Showcase uh, with Cena China. And uh, he, that was a great, great, great time. And that's the reason why I'm here right now, being invited by Roger Zhang from Cena. Shout out to you guys. Thank you so much for um, getting me out here so I can share my stuff. Thank you to the organizers for having me as well. It's an honor to meet good people like Vince Zhang. And I'll, I'll be honest with you, brother. I've never met a, someone whose heritage of Chinese, Jamaican, <laughs> and American living in New York City. I mean, that's General Tao's jerk chicken, man. It's the most delicious <laughs> thing you'll ever have in your life. I'm telling you, I'm going to come here. I'm going to eat good food. <laughs> that's right. That's right. The 3x3 boys, the celebrities are in charge at the moment. The selfie boys. Good fake. Up. Tap. For the two. Hits the tin. And Qingdao for the jumper. Yes! Knocks that down. A big shot there. Sorry, that my mistake. Check that. There's a big shot there by Dong Jun, or a.k.a. Daniel, the TV host celebrity, the Korea 3x3 team in white. So 
Good call that I always say when commentary, when you make a mistake, check that. Yeah, but also I want to see these brothers play. I mean, I got to talk to them outside the court, and they're really passionate about the game, as you should be. But they also got that chemistry, that like, not that freaky yeah. twin thing that most people have. Oh, hitting down with the two behind the arc. Right now, my man, G.U. Chen, showing what he got about. It's the tin, fouled on the charity stripe. Number 23, Kim Dong-woo. Well, one man who's been a little bit quiet compared to previous tournaments, 3x3 tournaments, the World Tour Masters, is my man, Min Soo Park, you know? Mm. I mean, when I say my man, I mean, I've been really, really enjoyed commentating Min Soo Park on all the, the, the tournaments that he's played. He's just, I mean, a short guy, combative, you know, that point guard body, but great shooter, you know, hit those runners, not afraid to really take on the bigger opposition, but he's been quiet. He's been quiet, but it doesn't matter. His team are doing all right. I mean, what's it like? I mean, you've been commentating on a lot of 3x3 games. What's it like to commentate in Korea? I haven't got to that venture yet. It's a different no, style I, of I, I, I haven't commentated in Korea, but I've been around a lot of Korean teams. I mean, they're, I mean, for, for Asian athletes, they're, they're big. They're really big. You know, I mean, the teams that come to Malaysia and play, you know, big guys. And the Korean ba ba Basketball League, very, very good standard. Good paymasters as well, so that's why a lot of foreign talent is very attracted to play in Korea. So, you know, and they've got some good teams, you know, the Sakers over there, so very high pedigree. I mean, right now I'm looking forward to see the Philippine teams, because as you know, Philippines love their basketball. Oh, yeah. And very competitive. Oh, right there, downtown, number seven. Min Su Park, support. my boy. That's your man. Yes, as that's the commentator's curse. As you say, they're quiet, they come alive. <laughs> And so combative as always, very quiet guy, doesn't say much, but you know what, look at that, when you see what you see right there, a noisy chap, you don't see that off court, when you see him having breakfast, he's just concentrating on chewing and digestion, and then after that, it's game time. Um, I used to be called when I played basketball, Jekyll and Hyde, because when you get off the court, you're one person, when you're on court, you're completely another, that's the transformation, and I'm ready to see this career team open up, I'm seeing they're very, very talented, I want to see how far they're going to go in this tournament. I mean, they'll be very interesting to see how they go. I mean, they've got the tools to do it. I mean, not the quickest guys in the world, the Korean team. But, you know, big, strong, bulky guys, like you said, age not on their side. But you know what? One game, they could just uh, get all the stops, hit all the shots. Min Soo Park, crossover. That's his signature move right there. <laughs> Min Soo Park from downtown. Man, leaving him behind the arc. He's putting everything on this game. You're right. He's a silent assassin. But coming back in WY saying, I'm not intimidated about you. It's a four-point game. This is getting exciting, my man. Minsu. What's the call right there, Mr. Referee? Oh, there's an injury. Hope that everything's okay. Look at that. Look at that killer instinct look on number 14, Sung Jun, a.k.a. Eric. The... European historian and the French speaking man. <laughs> it's funny you say that. The brothers actually, they come from Seattle, from Washington, so they got American style basketball in their veins, and now they're back in Korea bringing that over there. And it's, it's, it's great to see a watch when you have the mesh of two different kinds of stuff. They're from Seattle? Yeah, from Seattle, Washington, yeah. Make it rain. Yep. No pun intended, because <laughs> Seattle and Rain, a big celebrity in Korea. So we're coming up with all the puns and not too many cliches right here, which is good. We don't want to get that. But Minsu Park having his best game so far this tournament. Let's hope he continues because when he is lighting up and electric, there's nothing stopping him. Do not give him an open look. When he gets some separation, he can punish you, especially from downtown. I mean, seeing that move right there, that step back is one of the most deadliest moves in 3x3. Dushan Bullet has perfected <laughs> that. Perfected it. As soon as you get that move, your defender going one way, you better knock down that too, but then also boost the morale of your team. Qingdao, they're giving it everything, but you know what? They're up against a better and bigger opponent today. And surprisingly, I mean, I must say, Vince, a lot of the teams from China, which I think about four teams, Pretty short for China for Chinese for China athletes. I mean, yeah, but when Cena China came to three bar in California, these guys were tall. Like I'm really? six foot two, six foot three in a good day. Oh, downtown once again. I'm telling you, Korea three x three is showing that they got some bullets in that chamber, and they're gonna keep playing hard. I like seeing it. But like I was saying, when I was watching them, I saw them. They're tall when they came to California. I haven't seen other teams from China, but you're right, they're probably pretty small. Yeah, well, I'm just so there's some big big guys who really know how to handle the ball as well but you know what 
This is a big country. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, we're seeing a different type of basketball talent. And some of them on the younger side as well are still developing and still learning the 3x3 game. It's funny I want to talk about that because to get to the Senior Elite Tournament, you have to go through a lot of hurdles to get here. I mean, thousands of players, if you see the pyramid. It's incredible. And, and here in Asia, 1.3 billion people are here. That's a lot of talent, but a lot of players you got to beat, a lot of teams you got to overcome. Let's have a look at this right here. There's a foul, but like they say in China, it's a conveyor belt system. <laughs> one gets injured, dee, ding. There's another one ready made. Can shoot, can score, can block, can play, you know, defense, a hustle, work the boards, so try to go for the tip in. And then they clear the ball right here. Here's Genglin. Genglin pulls up. Can he hit the two? In and out. Good rebound, kick out. Here they come. Th Korea 3x3. There's a foul right there, but referee said continuation. What can they come up with right here? Trying to get the... Oh, good hustle by Minsu Park. Showing what he can do off the ball as well. I mean, Minsu Park right now showing no fear going to the rim. And I can see why this is your favorite player. Watching this play here. Knowing he's getting the steal, but be very careful where his body is. When you're able to push away, when you play basketball, you got to be on the ref and maybe they're going to give you the call. Oh, <laughs> like Lopat gets the putback, and your favorite player right there, Sung Jun, Eric. My man Eric, I'm telling you, this guy may be a pretty boy, but that man bun, I'm a little, little... <laughs> you said it, you bun. said it. I'm a little bit scared of the man bun, but I'm going to shout him out for that. But if he shows that he can play ball, you know, I, maybe I do a man bun before the end of the tournament. No, I'm not. I'm never doing a man bun. I can't well, uh, you know what? Objectively speaking, if you, I mean, if you... Well, going out on the town with him one night, I think you'd be talking alone, uh, talking to yourself a lot because everybody would be talking to him. <laughs> guys and girls, nice guys. Well, Minsu Park crossover, good pass on the inside. Three second call, good eyes by Mr. Referee Sharp. You gotta be careful with the three second call. Again, as fast as three or three is, they still have rules and you gotta follow them. If you don't, you're gonna get penalized just like this. Pull up right here for the two, yes! Nothing but net. A big, big shot there by number 30, Liu To. That's a good shot right there. That very much needed. It's a two-point ball game. That's what I'm talking about. You thought that Korea 3x3 had this game in the bag, all right? Had the body bag, called the quarter near it. It's right now going to the graveyard. But as you see, when it comes to this fast pace game, a couple of threes, you're back in this game. A couple of twos. I'm sorry about that. That's all right. It's a common mistake for the two right here. Oh, physics. Work the glass and in. What a Big, big shot there. As I always say, the bank is open 24-7. Call him TD. It's open up late, and he's using it to his advantage. That was a beautiful play. Good shot there. Career with a stop. Career 3x3 from the baseline. Hits that shot right there. Daniel Dongjun. Good shot. And 17-12, just like that. We said it's a two-point ball game, just like that. It's now a five-point ball game. And as you can see, that's a seesaw battle. When it's going down on both sides, you don't know where it's going to go. And now it says, wait, who's going to miss first? Oh, going up for another two right there. Ah, nothing but air. He's blowing out candles. <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> Teaching me about the New York goals. 17-12 in favor of Korea 3x3. Don't forget the Korea 3x3 team. Best plays in the 3x3 fraternity. Making up this team. And they are up. What's the replay right here? I mean, Look right at here. that by Minsu. Showing it, but he didn't finish his breakfast. When you get to that rim, you got to make sure you're using that bank. But it's a very physical game, getting the foul. Who was getting physical out there? Stay disciplined, boys. Do not fight. Please do not fight. We don't want to see any handbags being thrown. We don't want to see any technicals. It happens. I mean, it does happen, but the one thing is the base sense is why can't we all just get along? <laughs> <laughs> Sound like a... A Miss Universe World Peace model. <laughs> All I want is happiness. <laughs> well, well, I want to see nobody injured. Minsu there. We we'll hope he's okay. Still 17 to 12, over four minutes to go. I mean, four minutes ago, that's a lifetime in 3x3. It's only a five point game. But if you knock down two twos, you are so back in this game that you can take it out. And it's fast. I mean, I'm looking right now. To see if he's going to knock down these well, foul the, shots. The last man you want to send is Minsu to the charity stripe. Oh, infringement. And that shot will count. 
Okay, Minsu just telling his troops to calm down a little bit. Oh, there's a lot of contact right there. <laughs> and Daniel Dongjun just playing Peacemaker at the moment. Get on with it, boys. Don't fight. That's what's showing you have veteran players right now. You can get passionate, you can get aggressive, but then you gotta realize if you get too aggressive, you can basically cost the game because you still can get ejected from 3x3 if you have two flagrant fouls and also technicals, and you'll be gone. Good shot there by Ji Yu Cheng. I must give credit to Qingdao. They've given everything against this very, very talented Korea 3x3 team from Seoul. And they came pretty close. Oh, he bricked that one. For Minsu. Yes! Nails it! Nothing but net! And that's what I love to see about this guy. He's becoming a real top player in this tournament. I'm excited to see it down the road if he's going to keep that momentum. Oh, finishing down low. Oh, they're not, they're not giving up. NWY. No, it's not going. Minsu, can he win this game for Korea 3x3? The script was about to be written, but the referee said, no, nope. stop writing, because it's going to go about another way, but it's still going to be Korea 3x3 ball. Three minutes and 30 seconds left. Slowing it down. Minsu asking for the ball. For the winner. Yes! Big shot right there by Kim Dong Woo. A man you did not expect to hit the big, big shot. But that's what it is. 22 points to 14. Korea 3x3. Take this one. 22 to 14. What a shot. And happy as Larry, the Korea 3x3 team. They are pumped. And they will be one of the contenders, you would say, to lift the trophy. But Korea 3x3, 21. And the Qingdao team, 14. So, Vince, not a consistent game. There was a bit of highs and lows, and the Qingdao team came back into it, but Minsu Park, my man, too good. Minsu Park taking it down low, showing what he got. He's a sniper, silent assassin. I really like him seeing him play. I like how he penetrates, but also I give it up to the brothers. I mean, Peacemaker, Daniel, but then Eric getting passionate. It shows that this Korea team may go far, but I give it to Qingdao. They did not give up. They didn't give up the fire. They kept it sparking right here, shooting from three, knocking it down. They're saying, they're still here. You're in our country right now. We're not going down without a fight.